here's me fucking chugging on with a thousand one hundred oh no sixteen hundred one thousand one hundred and sixty against a human team next next season i've got i've got to uh oh his name's coach 14 is 14 11 and he's level 14. isn't that outstanding plus movement blitzer guard all right good one one zero though he's unbeaten fucking humans rocking it hello freak hello Ali yeti Hello, Crazy Lima. Hello, Devil Eye. Devil's Eye. <laughs> you got humans, yeah. Humans, they should be all. They should be all right, but uh, they're not good in a fight. But if I roll four double skulls in twelve, in twelve, but if I'm on more double skulls than powers in thirteen blocks, <laughs> could be in trouble. <laughs> um, but yeah, I guess next season I'm gonna have to do a Crucifer Anna or a Ducky. As, as Ducky has done. It's just so effective. And God knows how many. Someone could go on... Um... <laughs> Ducky would probably concede. If someone could, could go on Goblin Spy and find out what how many of, of uh, Christopher's wins are concessions, please. That would, that would please me. Hello, Fish for Fat. Yeah, humans, obviously humans are a bit shit. And you're always happy to get humans, but you know, at low TV they've got block and dodge and movement. They're not, they're not an auto win or anything. Chaos doesn't get auto wins by matchup. They just get auto wins by dice, don't they? And obviously I'm not getting any of this TV. <laughs> Ten, con a third of his wins by concession. Fucking hell, that's pretty good, isn't it? Because twenty five six seven isn't that good a record, is it? Or twenty five six three, whatever it is. That isn't that good a record, but you you jam in them extra ten concession wins and it starts looking pretty fucking good. I mean, you'd have probably won them all anyway. Let's be honest. I, I'm, I don't wanna, I don't want to turn into a dode here, implying that he wouldn't have won the games that one of his opponents conceded. He probably would have done. But still, it's still nice to get the wins without risking your players dead and everything, isn't it? If Ducky hadn't just conceded straight off the bat, maybe Ducky wins that game but gets half his team killed. Maybe he gets half his team killed and loses. There's actually there's actually only three Curse Warriors on this team, but only because one's missed next game. It wasn't by choice. I didn't purposely create a weakened team and imply I was some kind of expert for choosing a weakened team. Ah, oh, shit, I should have saved that. Nah, Shawnee, I just said that. I wouldn't I wouldn't really do that. <laughs> I wouldn't really I wouldn't really choose to start with the suboptimal team for no reason. Yeah, but you know, it a bit much, but you still if you'd played out you might have drawn, right? Right, Ducky, but you might have had your team killed. So Yes, he probably would have won the games. He probably would have won all the games that people conceded. Yeah, exactly. It's um, it was very unlikely. That, that's yeah. I'm not. I'm not implying that he's got really a bloated record from his wins, but but obviously, some chances more than no chance, isn't it? Wise words indeed. Right. Let's do safe moves first, eh? There's a screen behind. So I haven't fully overcommitted.
But it's a bit of an overcommit, isn't it, maybe? It was like watching Jimmy, you dirty dingo, show me. <laughs> I could just steal Sage's emotes like how he stole my sound effects and then that could be Jim Ban. <laughs> Freak. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Sean. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I didn't think of that, but it was a good shot, wasn't it? The old Ogre Blitz. Wow, it's ball gone on no balls against Claw! <laughs> wow! <laughs> wow, holy shit! That's fucking rowdy. That's ra rowdier than fucking Lupac, that is. <laughs> Blocks pretty good skill, isn't it? Just qu oh god, just quietly blocks a pretty good skill. I don't, I don't want to lose to a potato, so get him back there. Oh man, I'm a break. Getting all the luck that I needed against uh, against uh, Vela Hoppier the other day. That's kind of all right where he is, isn't he? Oh well, is he? No, he's not. Might as well run forward. And then punch that guy into a claw, mighty. Right, not a bad turn. <laughs> Why couldn't the game against the Orcs gone like this? <laughs> yeah, it jumped toes. It was ridiculous, wasn't it? Okay, now. <laughs> Recovery mode. <laughs> I watched it. I watched it back and... Uh, I watched it back, and I think it was the first the first thirteen blocks. I made four double skulls and three pows, <laughs> and and my opponent made four cars. <laughs> oh fucking hell! Yeah, that's true, John Tills. That's true. The, the, those dice rolls would have killed it. An orc lineman. Oh wow, he failed the dodge. Glorious. Two dice this one. I think I'm just going to go for the score here. But of course, got to make a three dice the first. Oh, baby. 
claw, claw not even required. For draw like this against the Orcs, it would have been all gravy, wouldn't it? Really would have been. Daddy levels up as well. Oh, Tree fag off. Yeah, but you know, let's not talk about the decisions. Let's talk about the dice rolls. Claw Mighty Blow got to make a couple of blocks and wreck people. Whereas in the uh, <laughs> in the game against the Orcs, he got to make a couple of blocks and did nothing. <laughs> I mean, I, I blitzed his, his troll with a Claw Mighty Blow block player and just got pushes. So, glorious. Glorious. Thank you very much, Satterfield H. <laughs> Welcome to Team Fantastic. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hello, Matty Boone. Ooh, PI. I've got more fame, so... This guy's probably wanting to quit at the moment, isn't he? Early concession, you'd think so, wouldn't you? I mean, but then he's won one, drawn one. He's level fourteen, so he might, he might stick it out. You know, you can't really, you can't really see from someone's record or anything whether they're going to stick it out or not. Can you? you never know. But um, hello, <laughs> Papa Piccolo. No, incredibly lucky today. Um, incredibly lucky today. Hello, you mad. I did just in Orange go. No, to be fair, TLC, it, it was his drive. <laughs> so, <laughs> so um, yeah. I mean, if this is happening against the Orcs, got a blitz against the Orcs and cast two guys in, in the first two turns, it'd have been alright, wouldn't it? But not to be. Anyway, I don't want to keep going about that whole game. With this game, being incredibly lucky. This is the luck that I... You know, I needed to be this lucky against the Orcs to even have a chance, I think. But now this poor fucker is getting diced. Diced to death. Unlucky. Is Rock Tomb a TM? Anyone know? Anyone know if Rock Tomb's a TM? Gold bottle cap, yeah. I I got one the other day. I I, I got a, I got a gold bottle cap from the uh, from the lottery thing, and then uh, I got an extra free, an extra spin and got a silver bottle cap. I was like, not bad. I'm just gonna hope to base 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 again, because now I've got the man advantage, man advantage and strength advantage. How do I not help their base, base, base? Let's do a blitz first. Rock Tombs at TM. Thank you, cool willy dog. All right, good. So I can make I can make a proper a proper build for um for what's he called for Bree Loom. And then, um, you know, just alternate between false swipe and rock tomb, depending on whether I'm catching or not. Is that a GFI? This is no fuck. Cock shit balls. Alright, 1v1 there is a bit shit. Much rather would have had the warrior up there, but never mind. Can't win them all. 
TM39, wow, John Cold. Is this stream in English? What the fuck was that? <laughs> it's in Pokemon's, Shawnee. <laughs> yeah, Judah Fago was, was he? He was a big disappointment, wasn't he, Judah Fago? Holy shit! Concession, maybe now. That's outrageous. He's been so unlucky. <laughs> Fucking crazy. Can make us a three now. That's pretty good, isn't it? Mm. Keep him on the ball, down and not have to block with him. And sack the ball again. So I'll free him up, then he can run around. I'm not too bothered about the hit on the ball, actually, am I? So I can make these blocks first. A journeyman. All right then, so go for the hit on the ball first. Oh, it's the same guy on eight. Oh, because I didn't change the setup, did I? Oh man! <laughs> oh, I guess it's better to just screen here then, isn't it? So go for this block this way actually. God, this is <laughs> this is something else, isn't it? <laughs> There's a Norse team called Herb Dirt. Base, base, base! Holy shit! And this is nuts. Yeah, exactly, freak. Exactly, right. It's typical, isn't it? You know, when it's when it's in the tournament for five hundred euros on the line, it's like double skull, double skull, dead, 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 dead. <laughs> and then when it's just a fun having guy with humans, it's just like I'll just absolutely annihilate him every turn. <laughs> All right, Tony. Oh. Ah, oh, well, maybe this other guy could score. I'm all right, him. What's he on? He's a loner. This guy's on free. with block. Interesting strategy, Cotton. Got to re-roll that, haven't I? Ah, shit. Oh, 
crazy. <laughs> what a crazy game so far. Bad that happens gives him hope. Um, he doesn't have an acceptable name, I'm pretty sure. Typhago, oh, that's pretty good. That's a pretty good loner name. Good afternoon, VIP Kogo. <laughs> Hello, Senai eighty nine. <laughs> I mean, I guess the claw could just go. Could power him and then he could try to score. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. That could work, couldn't it? Or maybe he could. No, he's on 12. Could do. One, two, three, four, five, GFI. Yeah, that, I like that. Alright, just do that one, that one safe move. And two safe moves. It's not that bad, it's not the end of the world. Because now he can go there. And the sweeper can commit to get a chain out with a pal. Oh baby. Guide you, Corona, you motherfucker. Act like you're strength 5, agility 4, for fuck's sake. Good lad. Maybe he's just not making that block would have been better. 
because then it couldn't fail, could it? Because they're both down there would have been pretty shit. But click first, ask questions later, that's what I say. Trading scammeries. You got two hundred. Ah, yes. Yeah, I've got. I've got. I'm, I'm the same. Like I've got loads of stuff. Oh, super VIP Ori lenses there. Yeah. Yeah, I've got loads, man. I've got loads of not dwarf cunts, but I've just got loads of fucking things on wonder trades. Like gibbles. I've got a million gibbles. A millionaire, what are they called? What you know, hidden hidden ability gibbles, and uh, 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 approximately infinite routes. <laughs> That's what I'm doing on Ultra Sun and Moon. I'm breeding routes, and then uh, what what my plan is with the routes is is to just have you know twenty perfect IV routes. To be my uh, catchers, well, not catchers, synchronizing it with, but then they can have, they can have what's it called, thunder wave and hypnosis. So they can sync and do something, and uh, I thought it was a good idea. Tyranitars. Nah, because you'd have to evolve them, wouldn't you? I, I didn't, I didn't even bother I breeding Tyranitar this, this gen. To be honest. But Gibbles, Frokies, Charmanders. Um. Yeah, chance, chance is easy to get a good one, isn't it? Because you only need. You only need like four perfect IVs. Stats don't matter as well if you get a shiny one because if you get a shiny one you can uh, you can bottle cap them, can't you? So shiny shiny Pokemon's got a lot better now because you can actually just bottle cap them. Also the uh, the warp thing, the uh, warp space ultra mega wormholes or whatever the fuck they're called. If you get them, um, you can get shinies in the wormholes can't you so that's good Jimmy I'm hoping you win Shom's ladder one day I think it would be great if the one footed transsexual autistic coach could be would be an inspiration to literally dozens <laughs> literally dozens <laughs> yeah <laughs> thanks maybe I just blitz with somebody n not him Oh no, I've got a bit with him. On a power one, two, three, four, five, GFI. I don't want a GFI. Mm, can't really chain him, can I? Do the bit first and see what happens. Next turn. Next time, gadget. Blow hit, kill him. Oh yeah. Nice. 
Right, not bad. Not bad. Thanks for the bit, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not cool, Willie Dog, in case, in case you think he's being realistic. I, I don't even have one foot. <laughs> Not much happened after that if I had a chance to one turn if I got a quick snap and a touchback and I got the touchback but didn't get the quick snap. Um so you know, lost. Unsurprisingly. Okay, so I'm gonna do some blocks, even though I've got to make this uh this GFI here. I'm gonna make the blocks. Cause I'm a fucking asshole. Hmm. Maybe I won't actually. He could blitz. I could two dice. If he blitzes, runs back. One, two, three, four, five, six. Could make it a three dice there. There are only two dice there. This is, I mean, this is really stupid making this block. But I've won, haven't I? That's the thing. <laughs> I don't mind the greed block so much when I've won. Yeah, you can, actually, if you can, you can go to um, you can go to the you can go to the YouTube where I have uploaded it. So I, I did my replay analysis where um, I uh, yeah, exactly. If yeah, it's ridiculous. All right, so he could do a completion. Maybe him and get him up to ten. Oh. Maybe him and get him up to get him up to claw is pretty good, isn't it? So he could he could pass to him who scores. Pretty glorious. He's just, he's just given up the ogre. Right, 
And then I'll just try to win 4 0. I guess flat, if Flat Fart scored three, that'd be good, wouldn't it? But I think I think that's a bit unrealistic. I think just go for. Just go for um, less than three, less than three. Yeah, just go for two. VIP squirrel dude. Yeah, exactly. Donate him too high, exactly. Biggest block. Got him. Oh, baby. Get out of town. Claw doing something. And mighty blow. It's pretty good, isn't it? It's actually a pretty good combination when you knock people over with it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get four players cast in the first foot. Right, I'm going to stop going on about that game. There's a nice quick snap as well, actually, getting these three dices that wouldn't wouldn't have otherwise been three dices. Might have averted a turnover there. Could have, I should have followed that, shouldn't I, actually? But I was thinking of keeping him free of tackle zones for receiving the pass or handoff. But even then, following would have been better so he wouldn't have to make a GFI. Go. Let's go, Gaidi Caron. You can do it. Oh, baby. Yeah, I should have. I should have followed. Then he would have been in, in for the six handoff, and then run forward. I did get three positive kick up events in a row. Yeah. You, you choose the type of, like, if you mean any kind of ball, then you do it in, like, uh, settings or something. Um, to get the to get that particular ball, you, you there was a code in the tabletop um, game, which Kurgo very nicely gave me his code. So that's how I got it, because I didn't buy the fucking board game, the new board game, because I just thought... There was nothing for me in it. Crazy, eh? Right, he's, he's put a bit of a threat in here, hasn't he? Have to do some safe moves first.
two, three, four, five, six GFI. can't GFI now, but I guess don't have to. Because it's still hard to get a surf from there, isn't it? And go for the GFI next turn. Ah, yeah, and you get the Newcastle shirt as well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, not even it does. Just four, just four, I'm not going to go crazy. He's gone for the hero play. He hasn't cancelled the assist, so it'll be two uphill. Oof, thank God for that. Don't even have to GFI now. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. <laughs> That was great of him, wasn't it? I can't always get opponents like this in Chance Ladder. That was fantastic. And, and yeah, he's, he's, yeah, he's offered up a surf too. Holy shit. Oh, wow. What a lovely chat. Uh, do you know what? I think I might not even go for the surf, though. I will see. Couldn't even get a push. Unbelievable, Joe. Exactly, the paper says no surf. So I'm not even going to go for the surf. I'm re I'm actually not, and not just because the piece of paper, just because I don't need a guaranteed removal to beat him. So, what's better than a guaranteed removal? Two star player points. Well, it would have been the the four on the armor would have been four on the injury, right? So, doesn't matter. Yeah. Oh my! He's got no luck at all. This is really fucking something else, isn't it? Holy shit. <laughs> 
He's down to five players. He on a six. Okay, now. No, he should have gone all men's LOS. In retrospect. What's the record so far? Uh, four three zero, which is all right, isn't it? Where's oh, the kick? If it isn't a touchback, oh man! If that isn't a touchback, it's the greatest kick of all times. Jim Pack. Boys, lads, lads, boys, lads, boys. <laughs> oh, it's a shame that you got the quick snap, though, to get those two guys out of tackle zones, wasn't it? <laughs> if an Aryan played chaos, <laughs> this would be it. <laughs> It's funny, you know, the, the fucking last two games have been absolute opposite spectrums of the uh, of the look, haven't they? Crazy. His problem here is he's got his catcher back as a thrower, and his throw is forward as catchers, which isn't isn't really ideal, is it? He did do save in his first year. Yeah. Made the pick up as well. Lucky bastard. <laughs> Sorry about that, that's uh, Sergeant Audit me. I don't know why, don't know why that's happened. <laughs> the true gym pack would have pissed yourself already. <laughs> would have already conceded because I've beaten him three times before. <laughs> okay, so this guy, he's given us a hit on the ball, hasn't he? Double GFI, hmm. Maybe he just does the blitz at the end. So get the uh, get the canoring threat. I think I just blitz this guy actually. Could have blitzed him with Claw Mighty, couldn't I? I wanted to score with him. A loan of safety isn't really the best fucking shout, is it? But it is what it is. Gonna go for the dreaded ball base.
Yeah, I probably should have thought and tried to cage the ball. You're right. I didn't even sandwich him, should I? It should have been a 4 plus 3 plus to get out. But now the surf's definitely happening, isn't it? Well, I say that. Double GFI to surf. No, just one GFI to surf. Oh, God. Please, please, please. <laughs> I always get excited when he rolls both downs, but it's, it's for the blitz and all that shit. Nope. Alright, so move him. Safe moves first here. Move him to there. Unbelievable, Jeff. Safe moves first. All right, and now the crazy risk of a two plus. I kind of want to follow. Three, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I'll follow. Then you never know. The, the ball might scatter that way, come back, and he might catch it. You never know. Stranger things than that have happened. <laughs> the <German guy. laughs> Similar. Similar to what I thought might have happened. Push this into a subsequent block. Oh, baby. Now he can come up. To make a three. Dudley death drop. Get the tables. Oh, God, it's so good. It's so good when you roll like the loop pack, isn't it? Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Fantastic. What is this game? <laughs> Everything changed when Jimmy finally agreed with Dot. <laughs> Holy shit, right, four, five, three dice first, innit? Can I get seven again? Yarp. Safe moves first. <laughs> Half a chance, half a chance of the 5 nil. Kind of want to protect both these now, now that he's got the ogre that can blitz.
So which viewer was kind enough to lose to you like this, Jimmy? <laughs> totally. <laughs> Crazy, isn't it? Yeah, Luva could have got cars. To be fair, Luva could have made six cars on the guy, but still. Imagine if this was the first Gear 4 games. Yeah, exactly. Lemon is good. God, it'd be glorious, wouldn't it? Instead of fucking having horrible hard fought draws. <laughs> I have I've lost 4 0 against Kemry before because basically this happened. They killed my team in the first half and then and then they scored three in the second. Yeah, I do need to try that 16 0 again, yeah. It was a good idea, wasn't it? I think I learned some things from the games. I'll have to watch it back and uh, and you know see what I learned. Because also dwarves were a hard one to do it against, weren't they? With all the tackle, I think it's going to be basically impossible to score sixteen. I think the thirteen or whatever it was was a good a good try because you know you just you're rolling so many one in thirty six chances. You're going to roll them eventually, aren't you? No matter how much dodge you've got or sure hands or whatever. Oh, was it high kick? Fuck. This might be a a four one then. Yeah, you've got to be really lucky to get a sixteen. Incredibly lucky. And yeah, obviously the the, the super team of death. Two rerolls for the last two turns. That that's worked out well. Rolled to get here. Oh man, feel this dodge. And ball carried to being completely exposed. Feel this. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, banged on. Right, first things first. Canoring threat. And then a secondary canoring threat. This is two GFIs away, this one, isn't it? Yeah. So, we've got the canoring threats in already. Blocks. I want it, I can get him uh, hit him from a better angle here. It's not such a better angle anymore. Misclick the follow. I don't want to blitz without claw mighty blow, but then I don't want to push him that way. And I could push him back. Central. Let's put him there. Fucking <laughs> out. Mm. 
If I go for the pick up with him and I fail it, then he can't score, can he? I just want to make his GFI. So he can make a GFI next turn if he has to. You can do it! <laughs> What a level then, blitz with my, my, I want to score with a mighty blow guy though, that's the thing. I am a Kaz away from levelling the mighty blow guy, but I'm also a touchdown away from levelling the mighty blow guy. So I thought, seeing as he's movement 6. Um, yeah, no, it is missing a block pro minor. <laughs> yeah, not missing it that much though. Pretty good. Um, looks like I can make it three dice. Then this beast man goes one, two, three, four, five, hand off. So. Four mighty blows worked out all right, hasn't he? This is a three into a three as well now, isn't it? Which is good. Probably shouldn't have made this in case it was a triple, triple skull. Use the reroll; wouldn't have been good. Shit, he's double GFIs away. Oh man, 5 nil. <laughs> Full loop pack. Brilliant. <laughs> 5 nil. What the fuck? It's alright, that, innit? So yeah, that, that was the plan for him to get him on the 17 like that. And, uh, I don't know how many, not that many I guess, because it wasn't that many cars. Um, only, for, only four cars. Um, but there was a lot of chaos, wasn't there? Um, it felt like more than four cars. Just because of all the KOs, there was like a ton of KOs that didn't come back as well. So like it felt like more Kaz than there were. But uh, it's <laughs> brutally, brutally one-sided dice. I'll take it. A lot of levels. I don't know how many levels. Four or five levels. Oh, I think I've got one of them saved. Never mind. Um... <laughs> More like in that yeah. yeah, it wasn't even a soft concede, yeah, exactly, yeah. Yeah, crazy. Hello, Yuri Stars, out there. I saw that, but I, I couldn't think of a, a German response. Um, <laughs> I think I'll be back in January, but I might be. I might stay till February, but I don't know, it's not set in stone. <laughs> yeah, when you, when you get a game like this, it's best to date a break. I know, right? It's crazy. But it's funny that this came after, like, the most unlucky game that I've played in ages. And then I get the luckiest game that I've played in ages straight after it. Looking crazy in it, back to back. About as unlucky as you can get, and then about as lucky as you can get. Five every game. <laughs> How many levels were there? One. Two. Three. Only three levels? Felt like more. 
<laughs> yes, as and I believe me, I'd 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 like to be back now. Um, but there are things that I have to sort out while I'm back in England, and it's not all sorted. So. Exactly, freak, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, that's there's similar kind of things in uh, there's similar kind of sayings in England, but uh, that's not true. <laughs> Yes, exactly, KLZ. Important things as well, I'll play Bloodborne instead. I've got, to, I've got to carry on playing Bloodborne, haven't I? That's the thing, John tells. I don't have any choice. This is like... This is my day job, isn't it? So... The Holland of Leeds. No, I'm in Darlow. Darlow. At the moment, I am in Kurgan. Um... I was thinking of a night out in Leeds at some point, but I just don't really like going out that much. And I could only go out once I've sorted everything out anyway. Fucking get on. 5 0 with chaos. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Imperial Augustus, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, fair queen. Um, I worked at Royal Mail, to be honest, and then and then I and then I was a, a, a welfare queen for a short period of time. Um, yeah, right, that was pretty good because the our our fucking the Royal Mail should closed down. That was it. The, the place where I worked closed down. Right, I got it by Typhoon. I already got the MVP. So. 12 AV bricks, pretty good. 51 blocks to 30, pretty good. 10, 19, 22 star player points. It just seemed more than that, didn't it? 22, because there wasn't that many cards, that was the thing. Like, there was only four cards. Um, GFI is pretty good. Catch is excellent. Uh, where's the throw? The throw isn't there. There was a pass. I don't know why the throw isn't isn't in there. Oh, there it is. Pass. All right, fair enough. I'm just being a derp. Just being a fucking derp. And then more pals. M more pushes than skulls, so that's better than the... Uh, that's the same amount of skulls that I rolled in the game against the Orcs. <laughs> so, <laughs> amazingly, games go better when you when you have... When it's the, your least rolled dice, rather than your most rolled dice. And nobody died as well, yep. It was amazing. That was like pretty much a perfect match, wasn't it? Unbelievable. Right, it claw for this guy. Gotta be, hasn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be claw. I'm not considering movement, but you know, it could be block. Or tackle. Um Let's see what Tree Fagor gets. Strength. Alright. Don't need to think about that one. That's uh, getting taken. Thank you very much. And uh, let's see what this one is. <laughs> Good morning, VIP sleeper sir. Uh, right. In that guard on mighty blow, I'm tempted to go more mighty blow now. To be honest, I'm tempted to get rowdy and get more star player points on them. Uh, <laughs> I'm just up here, dude. <laughs> Truthful coconut diamonds. Yeah. Um. Holy shit. 
Right. Um, okay. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.